Look, I'm, I'm really not interested. Okay, this will just take a minute, Jack. It's really important. Okay. Fine. As long as you don't take too long. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Carly. I couldn't talk. Is she gone? Yeah. Yes, she is. But why wait? You really gotta make this fast. You really shouldn't call here. I know. I know. I'm sorry, Jack. I just couldn't help myself. You know what it's like when you hear something really incredible and you just have to share it with the most incredible person in your life where you swear you'll just burst? What's going on? I finally got my hands on those papers I've been waiting for from Hong Kong. They proved the racehorse is mine, Jack. You sure? Yes. It's all right here, right in black and white. Goodbye, Craig. Hello, Easy Street. I just have to claim that horse before Craig claims it for himself. If he finds out that Winston bought the horse with his money, you know what? It's too late. For the first time, I'm going to beat Craig to the punch. Isn't it amazing? I'm really happy for you, Carly. No. Be happy for us. As soon as we know Julia's okay, we are in the clear, Jack. We can finally be together. I just, I have to put my arms around you, Jack. Will you please meet me at the boathouse? I, I can't. I have to work. Well, it's pra practically on, on your way to the station. Please, just five minutes, Jack. Carly? Are you there? Yeah, I'm here. Did you hear that? Hear what? A sound. Like someone was on the line. Honey, are you there? It's probably just interference. I'm on a cell phone. Look, Jack, I will go and drop Parker off with Hal. And then I'll meet you at the boathouse, okay? Yeah. Okay, but I can only stay for a little bit. It's okay. Please, just five minutes. Okay. I'm on my way. Y yes, thank you. Well, you sure haven't lost your charm, Hal. Thank you. <laughs> hey! Hey. <laughs> hey, buddy! Boy, are you a sight for these sore eyes. How you doing? How you doing? <laughs> so, um, why are we meeting here? Is Barbara not at home, or...? I don't know. Why? What's going on? I was going to tell you. Tell me what? I moved out. When? Well, the last couple of nights... Come here. I've been sitting at a desk just like this one right here. Wow. I can't believe it. I can't believe you actually left Barbara. I, I thought you two were... Oakdale solid, upstanding. Rather live in misery than risk a scandal. Don't. No, I'm, I'm sorry. I really don't mean to make light of it, Hal. I'm sorry. Uh, no sorrier than I am, believe me. So how are you holding up? I'm hanging in there. Good. I don't want to pick a fight or anything. But if you're spending all your time here, I, I really don't want Parker bunking in a cell somewhere. We're not going to stay here, Carly. I booked a room for us. I'll have a nice, warm bed. Don't worry, I'll be with him the whole time. And you'll tell me where, right? Yeah. Don't worry, I will. Parker and I are going to be just fine, right? This, this is too weird. I mean, after all the flack you gave me about living with Craig and... I don't, Carly. Don't do this. Well, it's not like I blame you. Barbara, she could tick off the Pope, right? And this get this come and get me game she's playing with Craig. It's That's really enough. Nasty. This is temporary. We'll work it out. Maybe. Right? Maybe not. Yeah. FYI, I'm getting new digs myself. I'm moving out of Craig's any day now. Oh, well, that's good news. That's good news. I hear he's getting uh pretty desperate. Pretty desperate. Yeah, well, he's hit some snags, financially and otherwise. Oh, uh -huh. uh, well, couldn't happen to a nicer guy. You two met in Hong Kong, didn't you? Yeah, well, he was business partners with Winston, but you know that. Uh -huh. Just spit it out, Hal. If you have a question, ask it. Was he there the day Winston Lowe died? Well, he was around a lot the last couple of weeks. They were working on that microchip deal. Mm -hmm. Was he there that day? 
Winston's heart was a time bomb. He hit a speed bump or something. The air went out of the balloon. End of story. Craig had nothing to do with it. Maybe. Maybe not. Interrogation room. Do you think you could do it in Parker's not here? No. I'm just asking some friendly questions. To nail Craig. Oh, well, just to get to the truth. What truth? Craig's been putting you up. You've been seen out together. Is he just doing this out of the goodness of his heart? Well, you'd have to find a heart or first. Or do you two you? have some sort of a deal going? There's no deal, Al. What have you got on him, Carly? Nothing. If I had something on him, I would give it to you. I wouldn't wear a wire. So nothing went down between him and Lowe? No, I'm sure lots went down. Business stuff. Legitimate business? Look, I cannot deliver Craig for you. I don't want to. Because you owe him? No, because I want to forget it. I want to forget about Winston and Hong Kong and Craig Montgomery. I want to get on with my life. And you can, after you tell me what really happened over there. You know what I know. Winston held me captive. Till he conveniently died. courtesy of someone who thought you needed rescuing, maybe? Nice try, Hal, really. But Craig was nowhere around when Winston breathed his last. Then where was he? I... You'd have to ask him that question, Hal. Craig's lousy. He's a lousy person, but he is not a murderer. That you know of. If I thought he had anything to do with Winston's death, do you think that I would let him anywhere near my son? But you know he's dirty up to his 24 carat handcuffs because you were petrified when you thought that he was on to you. Just let it go, Hal. Not when he can hurt my family. I'm not going to let you? it go. Are you? Part pit bull or something? I'm a cop. Craig is dirty, and I'm not going to let him walk. Let it go. You have a great family. You have wonderful children. Enjoy them. Stop wasting time, Hal. Life is too short to be spending time thinking about Craig Montgomery. Here is just what I need. You're taking my advice? Oh, why not? Why now? Mm, well, because at the risk of the sky falling in, I am admitting that there is the slightest, remotest, infinitesimal chance that for once you might be right. <laughs> I could get used to this. <laughs> okay. Parker, you have a great time with Daddy, okay? I'll see you soon. Kiss Mommy goodbye. See you.